Hey, what's up everyone? So in this video today, what we're gonna be doing is taking a look at something that helps you look at your coral a little better. So let's get to it. Now I know that I've been doing a lot of reviews lately on my channel on uh, either items that were graciously sent to me by companies or items that I purchased and I hope that you're enjoying them. If you do enjoy the reviews, um, please let me know in the comments down below because my intention on the reviewing of the items is to give you an idea of stuff that's out there and what I think of them. The initial review is just basically going to be like a setup of something or to take a look at um, the item itself, but the main review will come later because I think unless you've used it over time and seen how it does in your system, reviews aren't worth anything. So I hope you enjoy them and like I said, if you want to see more of uh, review kind of uh, topics and, and videos, uh, please let me know in the description down below. So with that being said, let's get to the video. So with Reef of Palooza uh, New York coming up, uh, we're just about a week away. I wanted to do a review of an item that I picked up in Orlando at Reef of Palooza Orlando. Uh, I stopped by the Reef Bright booth and had a discussion with Tulio from Reef Bright. And besides all the crazy lights that he has and, and the different fixtures and his knowledge of lighting, was this item and immediately when I saw it I fell in love with it. It's called the Reef Bright Aqua Viewer and really what it is is just a magnifying glass that has LEDs and a push button with a leg attached to it. Now what that does is all you do is push the button once and you have white LEDs, you push it a second time, it has blue LEDs. There is another model that has white and red LEDs. If you want to view your tank at night and just see if there's any critters roaming around or any pets that may be in the tank, and the red one will allow you to do that without disturbing any of the, of the fish or anything in the tank. I particularly like the blue one because my primary use and concern for this is to take it to shows and also have it uh, when I buy coral um, and dip them to spot any pets that are on the piece. Now I have a piece of green Matipora you can see right here and automatically you can see just what this does. Look how close you can get in on your coral and see what's going on. You can see anything. You can, as, a matter of, as a matter of fact you can see those little hairy things coming off the the frag plug, well that's a brittle star that has attached itself to the frag plug and now that it's in a specimen cup is now coming off and roaming around. But look how close you can get to examine your coral. It's really awesome that you're able to do this just at your table looking at the frag before it goes into a quarantine system or your, or your main system and your display and you don't have to worry about pests being in there. While you, and it just brings a new aspect to dipping your coral. Now, as far as the construction is concerned, it's a heavy duty plastic. Uh, and like I said, it has this leg on it, which will allow you to view your coral as you're dipping it with your hands free. Now, what that does is if you do have a pest on the coral, you can get tweezers or whatever, and you'll be able to work with both hands while you're looking through the magnifying glass, which is awesome. So, in just the short time I've had this uh, since Orlando, I put it to real good use. The battery life is outstanding in it, and I would say this is well worth the money, okay? Uh, it's, it's my favorite tool in my arsenal when I dip and inspect my corals because of the, how close I can see anything going on with my coral. So while you're at Reef Palooza New York, stop by the Reef Bright booth and um, talk to Tulio, check it out. Uh, he'll let you know where you can pick it up. And uh, also stop by reefbright.com. I will leave all the links to Reef Bright in the description down below. 
while you're walking around looking for ReefBright to pick up uh, information on this uh, tool, stop by the Fisher Hex booth. That's where I'll be and uh, hanging out with Fisher Hex and Billy Pipes and uh, different YouTube uh, people that you may know and uh, say hello. That's basically it for this short video. Definitely check out the links below, leave a comment, and if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell for future videos. So that's it for now, and until next time, this is Scott. I will see you soon around the reef tank. Thank you for watching this episode of Roscoe's Reef with Scott. As always, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe.